More activity from the steamboat geyser in Yellowstone National Park. The U.S. Geological Survey tweeted today that the geyser erupted for the fifth time this year. Steamboat had frequent eruptions in the 60s and the 80s. Well, this is video of the geyser erupting earlier this year. Experts say there are no implications for volcanic activity, but there are good implications for viewing some spectacular geysering this summer. Thousands of small earthquakes, geyser eruptions and rising magma raised scientists' concerns again on Monday, the 10th of November, 2025. The calm morning atmosphere in Yellowstone National Park suddenly turned tense after thousands of small earthquakes were detected in the park's geothermal area. The unusual seismic activity was first recorded at 8.20 a.m. local time, setting off alarm bells at various geological monitoring centers in the United States. However, it wasn't just the number of earthquakes that surprised scientists. Just minutes later, two major incidents rocked Yellowstone. A major earthquake, measuring 7.9 on the RTR scale, was recorded as an aftershock from the series of micro-earthquakes. This quake caused widespread shaking across northwestern Wyoming and raised concerns among residents and tourists who were in the national park. Most surprising of all, the major quake was immediately followed by a sudden eruption of Steamboat Geyser, the tallest and most legendary geyser in the world. The eruption sent hot water, steam, and material from beneath the earth, more than 1,700 footy 518 mertia into the air, making it one of Steamboat's largest eruptions in years. Footage from a visitor's camera shows the dramatic changes in the Norris Geyser Basin. The footage was taken shortly after a major eruption at Steamboat Geyser, the world's tallest active geyser, occurred some time ago. The short video shows a stark contrast between the conditions of the area before and after the eruption. An area previously characterized by small hot springs, grassy terrain, and low vegetation now looks completely transformed. The ground is covered in grayish-white mineral deposits. Steam is rising from several new spots, and some areas appear to be flooded with hot water flows that were never there before. Scientists from the USGS and the Yellowstone Volcanology team say this is not an ordinary eruption. Increased underground activity, including a history of magma rising in recent dashes, led researchers to conclude that there is an unusual dynamic going on beneath the national park. The spike in magma activity we detected last week now appears to be directly connected to the recent series of earthquakes and geyser eruptions, said Dr. Emily Harper senior volcanologist who leads the Yellowstone monitoring team. We are watching very closely to see if this is an early sign of larger volcanic activity. Yellowstone is known as one of the world's most active supervolcanoes, and any unusual activity like this fuels speculation about the potential for a major eruption. Picture a calm morning in Yellowstone National Park. Steam gently rises from the surface of the Norris Geyser Basin's hot pools. Then, in a matter of seconds, everything changes. It's real, and Yellowstone National Park is in the midst of something terrifying brewing deep beneath the caldera. While there are no immediate signs of a supervolcano eruption, the combination of earthquakes, geyser eruptions, and magma movement has scientists on high alert. Yellowstone National Park is currently closed to the public indefinitely, while experts continue to closely monitor seismic and geothermal activity in the area.